This is Ben from the Railroad Yard and Hubcap Hobbies, and today I am out in the desert in a ghost town known as Rhyolite, Nevada. Rhyolite is near the eastern border of Death Valley National Park. Now, as you might have guessed, it was once a booming mining town in the early 1900s. With the discovery of gold, Rhyolite's population went from zero to 3,500 to 5,000 people at the peak of its boom. By 1907, Rhyolite had electricity, several stores, a bank, a hospital, its own newspaper, and even a stock exchange. The town was served by not one, but three railroads, which was unheard of for mining towns at the time. However, Rhyolite's success was short-lived. By 1911, the mines shut down and the population quickly dropped. Eventually, the town lost its electricity, and by 1920, the population had gone all the way to zero. Most of Rhyolite's buildings were salvaged for materials or moved elsewhere. However, its train station has been preserved. The depot opened in 1908, but its days of being in the rail business would be short-lived, with the railroad being dismantled around 1919. In the 1920s, Rhyolite started to experience a revival. It became a popular spot for tourists and even a filming location for several movies. In the mid-30s, the depot was repurposed as the Rhyolite Ghost Casino. The lower part of the station was used for gambling. The top part became a brothel at one point, as it is fairly close to Las Vegas. The casino didn't last all that long either. With the Second World War putting a strain on the economy, it was forced to close. By the 60s, the depot had been repurposed again as a museum and gift shop for tourists. Today it is managed by the Bureau of Land Management, and efforts are being put forth to further preserve it. So that's Rhyolite, Nevada. If you've ever wanted to experience an authentic western ghost town, this is the place. While you're out there, make sure to also visit the Bottle House, which is constructed of over 50,000 glass bottles. Anyway, thanks for watching, and if you want to see more railroad-related videos, be sure to subscribe.